name's Trevor. Welcome back to the Arctic Vet YouTube channel. Today we're going to do something super fun and I'm real excited for it. It's just Jessica and I and well this little car behind us. <laughs> Wait for him to pass. I just have a feeling that we know them. <laughs> so let's roll that intro. seeing these headlights pull up on us and well now they're behind us so we messaged them and said huh sent a picture is that dad back there <laughs> and we get a hee hee <laughs> and sure enough <laughs> that'd be a dad and a mom Val and a Matthew and maybe some more in there <laughs> They're headed the same place. Oh no. Oh no. Here they come. They're going to overtake us. Oh no. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh no. What are we going to do, guys? They're going to beat us. So we're on our way to Wichita because my brother and sister-in-law are getting baptized today and I am super excited for them. And there they go. <laughs> All right, hold on. We got to drop it a gear now. <laughs> we can't let the parents win. No, no. <laughs> I wonder where he's got his cruise at. <laughs> oh goodness. I'm gonna have to ask him later. Go ahead and end it. What's up guys? We made it to the church and now we're about to head into the, um, oh my goodness, into the auditorium with everybody where my brother and my sister-in-law will be getting baptized. So I'm super excited. I'll take you guys in there. Participate with Jesus in the death, burial, and resurrection. And so, what we do is, it, it, he, he's, re, he's invited us to declare him as our Savior. The Word says that when we declare him before men, he will declare us before his Heavenly Father. So, I want you to see what's happening here today. You guys aren't the only ones watching. If you're watching online, you're, you, you're not the only ones watching. Heaven is taking note of what's happening here today. When you declare Jesus to be your Lord and Savior, it's not just something that we watch and we celebrate as a church. It's something that heaven erupts with praise as your names are declared in the heavenlies. And so this morning, I just want to remind you that we get, if you're in here, you're not here to watch. You're here to give praise to the Lord. And you're here to, you're here to um, imitate heaven. Anybody want to imitate heaven? I tell you what. I'm tired of imitating the news. I'm tired of imitating social media. I'm tired of imitating what the, what the world's put out. I want to point my life to imitate what God has done and what heaven is doing right now. And so when we get to do that, the way we get to do that is we get to celebrate like heaven celebrates. And as people, when we get to pray, with, pray for people, as they're getting prayed for, you just you can extend your hands and you can pray for them. And as they rise up out of that, I want you to know something supernatural has happened because it's, it, it reminds us that the old man is dead and buried, but the new man is resurrected into new life. And so addictions, <laughs> addictions stay in that water. The old man, the old way of thinking stays in that water. The old, the, Everything that God wants to do, everything that He wants to resurrect, even healings in your body, they come up. And whatever's been spoken over you, we just buy it. And it's, it's part of, it wasn't ever spoken over the new man. It's all been spoken over the old man, which has no hold in your lives. Isn't that good? Live. Isn't that good? Come on. So there is there, there is new life to be had, and whether you're young or you're... Or you're you're, there's, we don't have any old people up here. Whether you're young or you're not, not as young as the others. Uh, 
it's a powerful thing when you declare God. So I just want to, and I know, I know Andy met with you this morning, and I'll, but I want to make sure that you guys take this moment, not just as symbolic, but as something supernatural. And when the enemy tries to remind you, tries to fool you, tries to lie to you, and tell you that he's got a hold on your life, you remind him of this moment. You remind him of the resurrection of Jesus Christ. You remind him that Jesus has made you all new, which means the enemy has no hold on you anyway. Isn't that beautiful news? And so we're going to celebrate with you. We're going to continue to worship here in just a moment. I'm going to give everybody a chance. We're going to start down here and go all the way down. Or you want to start? You want to be the first one or the last one? First one? Come on. Pastor Pam, are you up there? Oh, she's down here because she's, you have an, there's an amazing kids church sitting up there in the balcony. Okay, do you know any of those people? Do you know any of those kids? Do you like some of those kids? Will you introduce yourself and tell us why you want to be baptized this morning? Hello, my name is Ruth Horn. I
this, but yeah. as she testified to Jesus, we, you see everybody out there? As she testified to Jesus, she said, Jesus healed me of cancer. Cancer, that's right. Yeah. And God will mess with our order. We'll think it only, that only, sometimes that only happens after this or after yeah, that. Yeah, come on. But God will go before and he will touch you and he will lead you into, into life. And where your physical body has been healed, he now does something supernatural in your spirit. It makes you eternal beings. And so this morning, but this is not, I just want you to know, this is a deep desire of God to heal you. Yeah. And so if you can do it for her, you can do it for you. That's right. And so if you have sickness of any kind, we're just going to take a moment. She's going to get baptized here in just a moment. But I just asked her to pray for everybody. We can do that. Just a simple prayer. incredible to see them my brother and my sister-in-law get baptized plus everybody else that was baptized man it, it was amazing it was so incredible in fact that i know a hundred percent that somebody's seen that and now they're ready to do it too they're like i want that i want god in my life i want i want the world to know that jesus is is in my heart god is in my heart the holy spirit is within me and i want the world to know and i know that there are people that will watch that have just watched that on this video and you're gonna feel the same exact way and i i just i want to be the first to say congratulations brother congratulations sister because this is the journey of a new life, of a new you, the old you, your old ways, they're gone, they're gone. And once you're baptized, the old dies and we're reborn in Christ. And it's amazing. It's absolutely amazing. What a, what a blessing. I hope that you all have a blessed day, a wonderful week, and we will catch you in another vlog. Have a great night and God bless. Don't ever give up, God is here with you yeah. You are a child, nothing but love is true This God is fixing you, keep your eyes on the prize That's life everlasting, only through Jesus Christ He came to die